Arizona Governor Katie Hobbs highlighted recent local wins in her first state of the address here in Yuma. Adam Klepp interviewed the governor after the event at AWC and joined us now breaking it all down. The governor's Yuma centric speech focused on immigration, water and housing as she also highlighted the local leaders she's looking to to fill key positions within her administration. Yuma will thrive for generations to come. Governor Hobbs says the state of the state and the state of Yuma is strong. However, her visit comes on the heels of an executive order which prevents county attorneys from prosecuting Arizonans who break state abortion law. Yuma's county attorney signed a letter asking Governor Hobbs to rescind it, but she says the order will stay in place. Yeah, I, I'm really confident in the legal foundation for that order. The governor also mentioned the water deal she signed with Lower Basin State governors preventing the federal government coming in to make cuts. She says her administration is focused on securing the water supply for all Arizonans, but did not say if she supports the city and county of Yuma's lawsuit over Colorado River water transfers to Queen Creek. It's something that we're certainly looking at in terms of what our position is on that. Local leaders continue to be tapped for key positions in the governor's administration. Governor Hobbs recognized Paul Brierly, who was nominated to be the director of the Department of Agriculture. She also asked Yuma Mayor Doug Nichols to serve on her housing and homelessness task force. What I hope to be able to do is present what the Yuma area's uh, true needs are and what would be successful and, and impactful here. The annual Yuma State of the State is a fundraiser for the Yuma County Chamber of Commerce. Executive Director Kim Kale says this year's event likely raised over $10,000 for local businesses. I appreciate the business community and the Yuma County community for helping us make this a success so that we can put in even more programs that help our local businesses create jobs. This was Governor Hobbs' fourth visit to Yuma County since taking office in January and her third visit in just the last two months. Reporting in Yuma, Adam Klepp, News 11.